Good morning. Good morning. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. OMG. So grateful and thankful for this day that the Lord woke me up. I don't know about you, but I'm so glad about it. And you know I got a word. You already know. Oh my goodness. So you know this morning, I want to give you my routine. I'm going to tell you how everything just lined up for me. I'm just thinking about it as I'm driving this morning. Um, I woke up probably about five, maybe a little before five. And um, so my routine in the morning is my time with God. Um, that's, that's how I start my day, by thanking Him and by praying and talking to Him. That's my best friend. And then I, um, I post my, my, my inspirational posts on my sites. And this morning, um, I was led to T.D. Jakes. You know, I went on um, Pinterest. I was finding some quotes by him. I posted those on Instagram. And um, and my, my routine is, that my, my, the, the second part of my routine is to um, listen to the word while I get dressed. So there, there, there are a couple pastors that I'm just really feeling right now. I'm just, I'm just really just, I'm just, I'm drawn to them right now. This morning I was like strolling through um, YouTube and I came across T.D. Jakes. And so I'm like, well, you know, I don't know why I feel led to watch this video. And the name of this, the name of this, um, it was like a Bible study thing they had last night, Bible study session. And um, it was entitled, Get Your Fight Back. And the stuff that he was saying, y'all, he was talking to me. It's like, I don't know who I'm talking to. You talking to me. Because everything he was saying, I was feeling. And I, and it just everything just lined up this morning. I felt led to listen to him. That word was meant for me. And I was like, oh my goodness. So let me just give you a little bit of what I got that related to me. A lot of times, this is for my strong people. This is for my people that everybody goes to. Everybody dump on. Everybody unload on. And um, what do you do? Who do you go to? Like, who do you have to go to? Who do you have to, you know, to uplift you, to inspire you, to motivate you, encourage you, <laughs> to pour into you? Like, who do you have, right? And so when I thought about that, it's like, ooh. I mean, I have people, but I, it, it, I can't get to them when I need to get to them sometimes, you know what I mean? And so what I do, what I do, and I have to do this every day. That's how I stay sane in the membrane. I listen to uh, the word every day. Every day. Sometimes all day. Sometimes, you know, half of the day. But I listen to it. I listen to the word every day. And I also, Rock City is a church in Birmingham, Alabama. I got tied in. Um, somebody sent me, um, I forgot. It was some, um, someone from my church was telling me about um, this, um, I forgot the name of it. It's like a award show for for um, for um, Christian singers and you know stuff like that. I forgot that I can't think, I cannot think of it. So I, I um, it's a person, it's a guy on there named um, Mike McClure, and I was just hit this song called um, Big. I think it's the, yes, the name of the song. The song is called Big. So that's I just listen. I've been rocking with them like that's my that's my second church. You hear me? And so they come on here on Facebook live every day and they have Debo. So Debo is like Bible study, right? So every day about 8.20, they come on live and I'm just, I'm on here, I'm listening. Oh my goodness. I'm just getting touched, getting blessed. And on Sundays, um, you know, Sundays is church. So I'm on there to, when I come from church, I'm, I'm on there listening to them like, I'm getting fed. I'm getting fed. Like certain certain times, certain days, certain months, certain seasons, different people are gonna feed you, right? And so that's where I'm being fed right now. And I'm just, you gotta go where you're being fed, right? You know, you, you go to your, your church as well, but that's where I'm really being fed. That's where I'm really being led to. And so with saying all that, that's what I do to pour into me. Okay, I'm always sharing that because. I'm thinking like maybe somebody else might need it. It's not for everybody. Just like I'm not for everybody. And I get that. We all, we're all going through different things and we require different kind of feedings, right? And so I'm constantly, constantly, constantly feeding myself when I can't talk to 
people that feed to, that, that, that feed into me, okay? When I can't always get to them, okay? So I'm constantly feeding myself through the word, through people that I feel drawn to, right? And I am just, that's how I, that's how I stay sane in the membrane. And I was listening to um, T.D. Jakes. I had to actually finish. I probably like maybe have 10 minutes left of, of, um, of his word. But I'm telling you, I know that was meant for me because I feel like that sometimes. Have you ever felt like, um, what's the word? How do I want to say this? I want to say it in the right way so you can understand it. Have you ever felt like what you believe didn't line up with what you feel? Right? When he said that, I was like, whoa. What you believe don't line up with what you feel. In these, in this time that we're in, the uncertain times, you know, it's it's a struggle for some people, right? And people are are losing their mind. They're losing. They're losing things, and and they're reacting. They're responding in different manners. And we have to be kind to one another because you don't know what another person is going through, right? And so I'm always, always, always trying to keep that in the back of my head. And I just, you know, I'm just, I, cause people, they, they might not, they might, they're not where you are. They're not where I'm at, right? I do these things to pour into myself. You have to find ways to pour into you. If you got people in your circle that are not pouring into you, that are draining you, you have to, <laughs> you gotta limit, you gotta limit that conversation. You gotta limit that, 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 you know, being around them. You gotta limit those things for you. Okay, you got to, you got to, you got to, you got a peace. Peace is my area code. I love, 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 love just spending time by myself, just doing what I want to do. I, you know, I'm around people sometimes, but sometimes I'm like, you got to go home, go about your business. Because I need, I need some me time. So make sure that you're taking care of you. Make sure you're working on you as well, because you can't help nobody if you ain't good. Okay? You can't help nobody if you're not well. So you have got to put you at the front of your own line, and that's not a selfish thing. It's not at all. You are your own rescue. Okay? You are. Anybody gonna rescue you? Because half the time, they don't know you need rescuing. They try They try to save themselves. Okay, very good. Very good. There you go. Ha uh ha, -huh, did the light bulb come on? I saw it. I see it. It's a song, isn't it all? Get the light on. Listen, you got to find ways to pour into you. You got to find ways to pour into you. I feel like I'm the go-to person for everybody, right? And sometimes that is a bit draining. So this is how I do. This is how I, this is what I do throughout my day. I'm constantly pouring into myself so I can be able to serve from my overflow, not from my cup, from my overflow, okay? The problem with some people, they're serving from their cup and they're drained. They're about to lose their freaking mind, okay? Because you're, you're pouring, you're serving from your cup serve from your overflow okay find ways to keep yourself uplifted find people you got people in your circle be around be around the people that they, they they keep you up like this the people that pull you down limit limit that conversation limit that being around them limit those things okay because it will drain you it will have you out here sad depressed all kind of things okay in these times we don't need that we got to stay up Okay, because we, we're going to win. We're going to get through this, okay? But you got to take care of you. Good job. That's a whole word. It blessed me. I got to finish listening to it, y'all, because it's just, oh my goodness, I need it. I might listen to it again. It's so juicy. It's so ooh, yummy. I love it. I love, 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 love it. Thank you, Lord. But this day, okay, today's my last day, and I'm on vacation for two weeks, and I want to. Mm, I'm, doing, I'm doing exactly what I want to do, because that's my business. I'm not, I'm not, don't put, don't try to make, don't, don't try to find things for me to do. I'm good on that. Anyway, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Happy Friday. <laughs>